Hey everybody, Chris with Funny Little Honey Farm. Today we're going to talk about the five most important tools that you can take with you when you go to the bee yard. The hive tool. This is my hive tool. It has a lot of junk on it. It's got propolis. It's got a lot of uh, years on this thing. and It's got some paint worn off on it. Uh, they have many hive tools. This one is mine. This is the one that I like. This is the tool that I like. It just make sure that you bring a hive tool with you because I don't know how many times I've gotten down to the bee yard and the first thing I've gone to do is open up one of the boxes and I've left my tool somewhere. So make sure that you always have your hive tool with you. Your smoker. You may not need this. You may not use this. Sometimes we take it down to the yard and it just sits there. But let me tell you something. This is a great tool to have if you go to open up the box and the bees are all calm and they start to come flying out of the box at you. You're going to want to have something to calm them down. So just because I say bring your smoker, it doesn't mean to go down there and smoke your bees out. You don't have to even use it. Just make sure you have one in case you do need it. A notebook and two things to write with because you're going to break one of them or something's going to happen and you're going to need to take notes. When I first learned to be a beekeeper, my teachers and my mentors, Timo and Shannon, uh, tried to tell me how important it was to keep notes. Um, I still am not great at taking notes, but I do have a notebook now and I do keep more notes than I used to at the beginning. And I failed a lot because I didn't take notes. A hair clip. No, I'm just kidding. It's not a hair clip. This is a queen catcher or a queen cage. Um, you, what you would do, and this is a bee frame, by the way. I have one here just so you can kind of see what's going on. Uh, your bees would be running all around on this thing, and you, you see your queen here, and you want to do more work. Well, uh, the best thing for you to do is catch your queen because while you're working in the hive, you don't want to hurt her. So if you can find her and you can keep her in this while you're doing the rest of your work, you know, you're ahead of the game. Keep her in here and you'd set her off to the side while you were doing work in the rest of the hive. So, very important tool to have is a queen catcher or a, uh, a queen cage. A flashlight. Flashlight is very important to have when you're doing a hive inspection. Uh, we get down inside these boxes, maybe you don't even want to go all the way down inside the box. You just want to lift the lid, you want to take a look down in there, and you want to say, okay, I see what's going on, I'm out of there. But maybe you're doing more of a detailed inspection, and you're pulling some frames out, and you have this frame, and you want to see, hey, you know, I'm trying to see the egg status in here. I'm trying to see, do I have day-old eggs? Do I have two, three-day-old eggs? Uh, do I have pupa? Do I have larva? What am I seeing inside of this frame? So... Something that's going to help you is a flashlight. A lot of beekeepers will use the sun. They'll stand with the sun over their shoulder and they'll look down into this. I have really bad eyes. The older I get, they're getting worse. So I really need this flashlight. And I can take this flashlight and I can look down inside of these cells and pretty much see everything I need to see. So very important, at least for me, is a flashlight. I'm going to give you a bonus item. That bonus item is something that I just talked about a second ago I have a problem with, and that's seeing things. So my bonus item for everybody is to go out and get yourself some sort of magnifying glass. This magnifying glass, you can see everything you need to see inside the beehive. Because you're going to look at things and you're going to go, I don't know if I'm seeing this. I don't know if this is what I think I see. What am I seeing? Uh, magnifying glass, awesome tool for that. So that's it, everybody. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you see, please hit the subscribe button, hit the like. If you have any questions, post them below. If you'd just like to make a comment, post it below. I'd love to hear what you have to see. If you think there's a tool out there that I missed, post it below and I'll talk about it. Maybe I don't have that tool. Maybe I need to get it. So let's talk about it. There you have it.